if I'm right, and, and Enron's Parmalat's world comes to Bernie Madoff's all around us, I have my own experience in Germany, in Britain, in some other countries, in this country, in Ukraine, where a manager can do whatever he wants with investors' money, and what difference does it make? If this is a money invested in a, in a German airline by Mr. Lebedev, or there are 5,000 Mr. Lebedevs, I've created in, in, in Germany 500 jobs only in the airline, and probably another 1.5 thousand in, in the production of, of, of aircraft, airbuses, which, which I was buying. It has been all embezzled, it has been all stolen, it's all fraud, money laundering, corruption. And why is that I'm the only one who is in, in, in place of the German regulators are investigating all of that? And why is that on top of that, there is a very s severe link to the um, Iranians inside the airline? I think airlines is the most dangerous uh, thing from the top point of view of the international terrorism. So uh, I've, I've got lots of my own personal experience, that's true. But in the recent years, I was more and more inclined to investigate it, not from the point of view of the businessman who lost money because he made a mistake. And it was not my mistake. I was a member of parliament for four years. So I was by local law completely prohibited from being involved in my businesses. But let's say I am just an investor. What on earth can I do in Germany? How do I know? what a German airline is doing in Dusseldorf under the nose of the local regulators, boards, I mean, police, secret services. How would I know it was flying into Iran? I don't. So, this is a global problem, and I'm just giving you an example. If this is corruption, fraud, embezzlement, money laundering, violation of American sanctions, then it also creates an interesting danger of terrorism in the heartland of Europe. These are links link in, in between. All of this dirty money are sitting in the same pots, with the same lawyers, with the same banks, with the same jurisdictions. So the world stands to gain a lot.